Shalom, all praises to Yahweh, Bar Shem El Shad, Bar Shem Kodash. Double honors unto the apostles and the elders of great most on the rule well. And Shalom to the whole full lack. This is Pai of the Jeremiah London Cam, and it's in news and prophecy, prophecy and news. I got an article here from uh, BBC News, and the title reads YouTube to remove all anti vaccine misinformation. Alright, now this is one that came out a couple of days ago. I was meant to go into it, but I never got a chance to. But Kahala Yam Yao Basham El Shah Basham Al Rakak Dash is allow me to you know, go back on it and um get into it. So low willing to be an edifying video, let's get into it, man. So it says um YouTube has said it will remove content that spreads misinformation about all approved vaccines expanding a ban on false claims about novid 20 22 uh yabs all right so basically what they bring into effect is youtube is is becoming a long arm of the lord it's lucky i weren't meant to say that the, the short arm of the of the law should i say in a, uh, basically if anyone ain't speaking favorably towards any of the people set up to distribute information about you know this this thing that's happening right now then uh you gotta get you know dealt with dispatched accordingly you know from off of their platform so let's read on so it says videos that say approved vaccines are dangerous and cause autism cancer or infertility right and we see the main thing and you know Nicki Minaj came out and said what she said it does feel a bit um, orchestrated and the reason why I said that is because um, <laughs> David David, I'm sorry Boris Johnson over here he even mentioned Nicki Minaj which just kind of threw me off I was like what the fuck like, and he said I don't know about that Nicki over there but I do know Nicki within etc somewhere within their cabinet that basically speaks about the Novid so where where he did that is just a bit a bit weird but at the same time you never know man Jake are waking up to the BS alright and they're feeling away so with that being said um yeah it, it could be anything but just highlighting that word that it was mentioned by her and look, look what's happened right after this, right? Or among those things that that will be taken down, the company said, the policy includes a termination of accounts of anti-maxine influencers. So you'll be dispatched from off of this platform, basically. It'll terminate your account. Tech giants have been criticised for not going more to count through a war to count uh, false health information on their sites. In July, U.S. President Joe Biden said social media platforms were largely responsible for people's skepticism in getting, a mac in getting vaccinated by spreading misinformation and appealed for their, them to address the issue. All right, so now we're seeing this is the fallout of that because of so much misinformation they say going around. It's made people not want to get vaccinated. You had um, up until recently, Andrew, Andrew Wiggins was saying he didn't want to get vaccinated. And then, that, but he did. But now you can still carry over. The lone wolf, the last samurai that's standing um, to basically not get vaccinated. All right. But what would be the claim as to why that would be the case? Let's say he's been watching too many YouTube videos because he claims he's a flat earther, amongst many other things that you'd find on what? YouTube. All right. So this this is kind of how they you know weaponizing this information of um, and only is is dealing with gunning for us man the prophets of the heavenly father Yahweh Bar Shem El Shai Bar Shem Al Rakar Kudosh headed by the apostles on down all right that's who they're going at first and foremost why why they going at them because this word is is basically what bringing about their deal downfall. Okay, it's causing a great effect within their infrastructure, the system. All right, that have brought through enchantments. All right, it's disrupting it. 
and not making it go as smooth as they would like it to. So it says YouTube, which is owned by Google, said 130,000 uh, videos were removed from its platform since last year when it implemented a ban on content spreading misinformation about no video vaccines. All right. In the in a blog post, the company said <laughs> about the no no vid yabs um, spill over into misinformation about vaccines in general. The new policy covers long approved vaccines such as those against measles or hepatitis B. Right, so anyone speaking out against vaccines. Is is off basically now? Let's let's quickly attack that because this is some BS, man. That's how you know this guy's a devil, man. All right. And what does the word devil mean? Uh, devil means deceiver. All right. So I'm gonna um, read this. Job thirteen and four. But ye are forgers of lies. Ye are physicians of no value. It's talking about Esau, Edom. All right. They're forging the lies, alright? This uh mag- <laughs> this thing <laughs> this thing that he's speaking upon, alright, is is it doesn't hold value, alright? What is what's the true value? Alright? Where's the true value when it comes to, to health? Alright? Let's get into it, alright? So it's the book of uh, Sirach 38 and 1. Honor a physician with the honor due unto him for the uses which ye may have of him, for the Lord have created him. All right. Verse 4. The Lord have created medicines out of the earth. All right. So the Heavenly Father has created, when he made the earth, all right, when you go back to the book of Genesis within the six day period, seven days, you know, the first. Uh, thousands of years the Heavenly Father made the earth in right, via the angels led by Yahweh Shai right, what happened they made through the course of time right, I believe on the third day if memory serves me correctly um, on the fourth day you basically had um, the Lord create um, you know the the, the, the seed the let me just read it's lucky man uh, twelve so it says this is Genesis one eleven and you how and the most had oh and the power said let the earth bring forth grass and the herb yielding seed and a fruit tree yielding fruit after his kind who seed is in itself upon the earth and it was so the earth brought forth grass and her yielding seed after his kind and the truth yielding fruit the tree yielding fruit all right whose seed was in itself for his his kind and the mo- and the power saw that it was good and the evening and the morning were the third day. So that was more than the third day, right? The Heavenly Father made the herbs. So he made it. And it was made for what? Medicine, 
all right you have different various herbs out there that are medicine unto us all right but guess what the heavenly father's blessed the physician all right that we ought to honor in that he can interpret the, the the medicines out of the earth to basically allow you to receive your strength once again through the power of the heavenly father so let's read that again verse 4 the lord have created medicines out of the earth and he that is wise will not abort them right so the wise will not abort him that's why when you tell when someone says oh, i got back pain and you tell them you sit you've just sat down too much in your lifetime you need to start doing back you know exercises and being more active etc etc um guess what happens i mean that that's that's a form of the physician not not necessarily that example uh dealing with the herbs but it's more to the point of when you tell someone something like that they'll be like nah man you ain't a doctor do you, you can't tell me nothing and then guess what you find out the doctor will tell them the same thing you told them all right but that's why you know if if <laughs> if the doctor's on point all right but reading on it says um i'm gonna kind of jump down to the point all right uh, so I'm going to start from verse 9 so it says my son in thy sickness be not negligent but pray unto the Lord and he will make thee whole leave off from sin and order thy hands aright and cleanse thy heart from all wickedness give a sweet savour and a memorial of fine flour and make a fat offering as not being then give place for the physician of the Lord. For the Lord have created him. Let him not go from thee. For thou hast need of him. There is a time when in their hands there is a good success. For they shall also pray unto the Lord. That he would prosper that which would they give. For ease and remedy to prolong life. He that, and this is the point, he that sinneth before his maker, let him fall into the hand of the physician. And that's what's happening. That's why these, uh, we have physicians of no value. No value, should I say. And they're basically doing what? Forwarding the affliction upon the people of the earth. Right? Because the Heavenly Father made no mention of this form of quote unquote medicine. Alright? Because really, it starts with keeping the law, statutes, and commandments of the Heavenly Father. For sin, all right, is what? Transgressing of the law. And the transgressing of the law, as it tells you in the book of 1 Corinthians, the 15th chapter, tells you that, um, um, let me get this go to it. Mm. Ooh. The better one. Romans six twenty three for the wages of sin is death. Alright. And that's that's really the point. So the more you commit sins, the more it leads to death. So for example, eating pork, that's a sin. Alright? Which may not kill you instantly, but guess what? It's gonna aid in your death, alright, which only brings about death. Okay, so we're expanding, we are expanding our medical and misinformation policies on YouTube with new guidelines on currently administrated uh, vaccines that are approved and confirmed to be safe and effective by local health authorities and the WHO. The post said referring to the World Health, health Organization. All right, so um, let's read this last bit here. Oh my lord. Personal testimonies relating to the Maxine's content content about Maxine policies, new Maxine trials. So even like you have all these people that are coming out and saying that they've taken the Maxine and guess what? That thing has basically messed them up. Alright. That they've they've got all kind of adverse effects within their within their body due to taking it. They're not allowed to to mention their story no more because it's proved, all right? So this is really what you're seeing happening. It, there's a lid being put on the people. And the move follows a similar ban introduced by Facebook in February, targeting false claims that vaccines are not effective 
or caused autism, among others. Um, but since the company has faced challenges in enforcing it, in March, Twitter announced that users would who repeatedly share misinformation about vaccines will be banned from their platform. So now they're banning you. So this is what's on me going to come Because first and foremost, it's the prophecies in the Bible. All right. And this man has an agenda to fulfill. All right. So let me start with this scripture here. It's the book of Revelation 13. And 14 it says and deceiveth them that dwell on the earth by means of those miracles which he had power to do in the sight of the beast all right basically talking about the fire coming down from heaven all right uh like the dropping bombs in um uh, yugoslavia all right saying to them that dwell on the earth that they should make an image to the beast which had the wound by a sword and did live all right the B system being Esau's power structure, all right, and he had the power to give life onto the image of the beast. That, he, that the image of the beast should both speak and cause that as many would not worship the image of the beast should be killed, all right. And this is where it's going. Right? That everyone's conforming to the image of the beast to give way for what? Uh, to give way for Esau's. Um, To give way for Esau's um uh for the thing right at Karagma. Okay. So yeah, uh, let's see. That's it. I'm just gonna close off on that man. So Lord when you edify, say shalom.